Hey guys, it's Killseth here. I'm going to show you how to flash your light on with the newest Probe 3. I'm going to be using the Probe 3 and the CK light. So the first thing, CK3 light, so the first thing you want to do is turn on um, your CK3. Well, have your, your drive connected to your PC. Mine's connected to my slimline and then have the power connected to either your same PC or another one that has the correct power cords and then after that you're going to want to switch on the CK3 and you'll notice that your probe also turned on when it's all connected so then you're going to want to open up Jungle Flasher uh, the newest one which is version 1.79 and when that opens you're going to want to go to DVD key 32 and you'll see fat key so what you want to do is you're going to want to hit fat key and it's going to ask you it's going to tell you to resend the command you should click yes then power off the drive probe and then power back on so let me set this to where you guys can see um, let me go about right there I think I could power it off power it back on at the same time I'll try though Right, hold on, I'll just put it right here for a sec. Alright, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click yes. And you're going to power, push the button, then probe the right part, and power it back on. And it should, say, your jungle flasher should say serial flash found. And you'll notice that. I'm probing the point right now. You can't really see it because my camera sucks. But once you do that, it should it should tell you another message should pop up, and it says to continue. You must ensure the probe is removed. So remove the probe, power off the drive for s five seconds. So click the button. One, two, three, four, five. Let go. Click OK. And then you'll notice that everything will pop up on Jungle Flasher, and then you're just gonna need to hit just save everything should be recording this shit but I didn't you will save all that then it will ask you light on firmware loaded to source buffer do you wish to auto load light on iXtreme and if you have the firmware inside the right folder just hit yes and then when you hit yes it should uh, should spoof it for you do everything for you now after that you're gonna want to go to MK32 MK MTK flash 32 and you're gonna want to hit light on erase now it's gonna say do you wish to proceed hit yes and then you're gonna want to hit yes again and now you're gonna watch for it's gonna say sending light on erase request to your port then it's gonna change to status 0 XD0 then you're gonna to want to hit power and then put it turn it back on and once you do that it will change from 0 XD0 to 072 and then it should say driving vendor mode and then now what you're gonna to want to do is hit right and then now it's gonna erase it's erasing it now it's writing bank 1, bank 2, bank 3 and now it's verifying, reading bank one, two, zero, one, two, three, and now it's done. And that is it. Now you can just power off your probe, and you're done. Thanks for watching.